Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. You didn't think I was going to leave you on the lurch there for a couple of weeks, did you, while I was in Africa? So I just landed here about an hour ago. First night is in a beautiful uh, guest house um, in Entebbe. This is where I'm chilling. This is where I'm going to be reading my little book a little later. I did have the option to go on a couple of excursions and go to the park, see the zoo and stuff like that. But I said, you know what? I want to do nothing. That's my main goal when I come here is do absolutely nothing, except I may go crazy and I have a Coke Zero and just go all out, you know what I mean? Um, so I've got Wi-Fi here, so that's why I'm uh, taking advantage of this and giving you a quick little diary. So it's a caribou in Entebbe. Of course, I've got to have my cage muscle beats. Did bring a little bit of supplementation across. I had to. Couldn't be too catabolic. And had some food packed, obviously. And um, just had myself a charu. They're not drugs, I swear to God, they're not steroids. No, they're malaria tablets. And I got myself a little bit of Weedabix there, a little bit of muesli, and good old casein, just when I need it. Now, this is the part that I thought was very interesting. I'm gonna do myself, uh, do my washing now from the clothes that I wore here on the plane. Now, look at this thing that I got from the camping store. It's a laundry wash detergent. I had 50 washes in there. That blew me away. I thought that was so interesting. So what I do is basically put this little leaf in there, add the hot water, throw this little leaf in there, and somehow that turns into like a soap. So, yeah. So I can wash my clothes. Isn't that interesting? So this is an interesting day one for you from Africa. So what I'm going to do once I've done this and put it out to dry, I'm going to have myself a little set down, read and whatnot, and then I'm going to eat. And they have uh, my food requirements here, which is high protein and gluten free, which is really good. So this is my first meal here in Africa. I am having a savory crepe. It is a cheap meal because I'm on a holiday and I can eat what I want. So what I do have in here is two eggs and some chicken and some pineapple with a very, very thin crusted crepe. Um, no oil, no butter, no sauce or anything like that. So I'm still keeping it relatively clean. And after I've had this, I'm gonna relax, maybe bask in the sun and let it digest and uh, have myself then a bit of a, a pick-me-up. Yes, I did bring some pre-caged here, but I'm not, I'm not gonna have that. I'm just gonna have some citrulline and some hydrocharge and go out for a little walk. And uh, there's some botanical gardens around here. So I'm gonna get a taxi out there and then do um, uh, probably a run and walk because this is my first day. So jog, walk, jog, walk for about an hour out there. So I'm looking forward to that. No schedule, so I'm going to enjoy. <sighs> so I found this uh, beautiful area, which is a botanical gardens here in Entebbe, to go for a run right around the lake here. I'm approaching some buffaloes here, hopefully. They don't charge me. But this is a beautiful place. It takes about an hour. I've been told to run around. So I've got the perfect timeline to hit this run. And there's a lot of species around here as well, which is pretty nice. And look at these birds here. Can you see them? It's like a pelican. Don't know if it is. So as I looked down earlier, bloody hell, there's a lot of monkeys over there. This could be fun. Um, I saw I was holding a lot of fluid. If 
from the flights that I've been taking. Got a lot of fluid retention, so jogging this out is the best way. I'm heading towards monkeys now. I don't know if it's going to be safe, but I guess I'll soon find out. I don't know if you can see, but that's where the bad boys have just gone up there. There's a few there just jumped out the tree. So I'm at a safe dif distance from them. I'll be good. If they come after me, it'll be even better because I can get rid of my full fluid retention a lot faster. All right, time to run again. Move. Thanks for watching guys, please like, comment and subscribe if you want more videos like this.